Warning, this video contains scenes of animals being dispatched in the UK using legal limit air rifles. Do not watch if you may be offended. Go and watch Charlie Bit My Finger instead. Hi everyone, I hope everybody's okay, keeping safe. Um, it's a lovely Sunday morning on the farm. Uh, I've been here since about seven, just after day, or just around before daybreak to get here first before they do, after the crows, rooks, wood pigeons, feral pigeons and jackdaws, um, shooting them under General Licence 42, um, damage to um, and spreading disease, feed stocks for uh, feed, feed stuffs for livestock, um, and that's the five species I'm allowed to shoot under that licence. The General Licences have changed January 2022, as of now, so if you do shooting, if you're shooting under general licenses, just check them, make sure nothing's changed where you shoot them for. You know, I've got to be very careful, make sure we do it right. Okay, today I'm using my HW80. This is a uh, Venom tuned rifle, as you can see with the badge. There. It's a 1983 gun, Mark 1, very early one. Uh, shoots lovely, 2 2 calibre. Um, it was sent to Venom in the very early 80s, not by me, <laughs> I was only about 12. Um, they've uh, fitted the custom spring, guide top hat, polished the piston, fitted their seal, um, shortened and recrammed the barrel, fitted the Slim Tech moderator to it. And I've got it in a CS500 stock and it's got a row and setback trigger. Using a Whitetail Classic, um, 3.5 to 10 by 40 and the ATN shop track for recording. Um, it's a lovely rifle, shoots really nicely. Thought it might time it came out on the farm, give it a bit of a uh, bit of action. Makes a change from PCPs. Uh, so we'll see how we get on with it. I've had a couple already from the hide, as you'll see now, and then uh, I'm gonna have a wander around now, see what I can uh, get by skulking around the tractors and the sheds, um, see if we can come across anything. Okay, speak to you soon. Here we are, tucked away in the hide, skulking in the hedge, looking up at the power lines. And my Deer Hunter heat jacket, I thoroughly recommend it. It's got a little electric blanket in it with a USB power pack. First one on the line. Instant kill. Apologies for this one, the netting. The camera's mounted on top of the gun, so I'm trying to trying to sort of keep in camo, but trying to keep things so you can see them. But uh, as you can see there, I bagged that one. This one landed to my left on top of the water tank. It's about 20 yards away. A straightforward shot. Obviously then the kick off, all the noise and everything else, so try and reload. Looking up at the power line, see there's one landed, wondering what all the commotion's about. Looks like he can uh, possibly see me but he's not quite sure. Forget to put the safety off and then down he goes. Next one, just trying to imagine the path through that tree. There's a couple of twigs right in the way. So I sort of work out the way to go and works out bob on. Chest shot, grips on and then drops. So now it's all gone quiet. So this is when I went for a wander around. Spotted this squadron of feral pigeons. Just waiting for one to present herself. Which one's going to win the lottery? I think we'll take that one in the middle. There we are. Down he goes into the cattle shed. And there he gets left. I'm not going in there. I had to be quick with that jack door. He landed. I'd flick the recorder on and shoot him straight away. <laughs> a 
feral pigeon off the roof, 35 yards. Went round the back, picked him up from down there. And the last one, another feral off the rooftops. Ferals are a bit easier than the crows because they don't actually take off when you wander around. They just sort of keep an eye on you and let you do your thing. And up there he stayed, ready for the buzzard. Ah, a little quick video there. Let me know if you'd like to see the HW80 again. Um, getting the rapid back, having a bit of work done. So that'll be on the uh, hopefully next video around the farmyard. Okay, if you enjoyed that, like, subscribe and share. Until next time, bye for now.